everybody. I'm going to do um, a little intro tonight. Um, I have an album coming out on tomorrow and um, so some accordion pieces and some piano pieces. I'm going to play a few of the accordion pieces for you guys, um, warming up for Jerry tonight. And then I have to run out for a rehearsal, but we have a special guest in the house. I don't know if it's announced. Is it announced? Al Trivio's in the house. He's right over there getting warmed up, ready to go. So hope you enjoy it. If not, you only got 15, 15 minutes of accordion and then you have rock and roll. in the tree and then he finds his parade and he's like Queen! <laughs> um, these are all pieces written about the coast up in Long Beach Washington um, this one is about dune grass Thank uh you. -huh. 
Grass inspired some really interesting dancing here in the Panther. That was super cool, and I had an interesting interpretation there. Um, okay, great. This is ocean, and uh, there's lots of ocean out there. Speak louder. Okay. Ocean. <laughs> really spooky and I realize these pieces are pretty dark um, sounding. They're written in the Greek modes which tend to be a little different in our ears. Um, this one is sand and this is like when the sand is blowing over the other sand in the wind.
Win. Okay. All right. Conley, Jesus, with uh, peer, peer, fear again, fear Jen, fear Jen, win fear Jen. You guys have a great show. We're sorry to lose you, Jenny, well, but thank I, you so much for taking time from your oh my big tour, busy my big schedule. World tour. What? Oh, yeah. My my world tour. Your world tour. Yeah. To St. John's. Yeah, going to um, Astoria and Portland. 
And St. Oh, really? I didn't know there was multiple shows. There's Seattle, Astoria, and Prosser, Washington. And where does one go to get those tour dates? Oh, man, my website. Oh, your website is? JennyConley.com. JennyConley.com. While you're there, this is Jenny's new album, which is actually incredible. Um, Tides, Pieces for Accordion and Piano, The Sea View Suite for Accordion, and Five Ostinatos for Piano. You can buy this record at JennyConley.com. I'm sure somebody at JerryJoseph.com will sell it to you. and uh, Or you can, Sunday night is here in town. Yep, Old Church. At the Old Church. Um, Thank you, you guys kick ass. Here you go. Thank you, Jenny. Yeah, bye. Bye, baby. That was beautiful. Good. You can get that record. Um, so, traditionally in, in many music circles, when you lose your accordion player, you look to um, Al Toribio. And, uh, <laughs> here he is, the guitar version of um, Roma Accordion. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Travis Shallow. Where do you go to Travis Shallow to buy his stuff? Probably... TravisShallow.com? That's what I would guess. That's you can get I these cool guess. mugs every morning when I pour my coffee, my cold coffee out of my ceramic mug, I pour it into my Travis Shallow mug to microwave it. It's true. And it tastes better with just knowing Travis's face is on it. <laughs> All right, welcome to Happy Book. We're so glad you're here. Glad you're here. I don't think this is this is on. I don't know, Dexaru. Nothing's changed. What? Nothing's changed. Is there something I'm supposed to press? things in the bottom are on. That goddamn accordion fucked me up again. Somebody stepped on the cord and got unplugged. There we go. Is that you? Is that you are? Stepping on my cords? Yeah, gotta do it. Trivia always sets me up. You're like, oh. <laughs> Why me your gears broken, yeah. dude? I'll take the solo. <laughs> Bummer. My God, we got so many things going on here again, and we're not even to the music. People are turning off. They're like, this show sucks. song would be my what? My seventh step? My yeah. eighth tradition? It's a start 
Okay, okay. I'm begging again. I'm calling in favors. I'm leaning on friends. Yet, do you hear when I say I'm begging again? For merciful grace Whatever you sin You said a light Was invasive It comes in it goes It slips through your fingers It fills up your soul on your shoulder that you're trying to cage and you can have laughter and you can have fear but one thing's for certain you will have tears
materialize Still in the end We're all gonna die And you can kick whiskey And you can kick dope But I carry it all home. And you can have faith And you can have love With your eyes to the sky For a sign from above Often these set lists are uh, scripted um, by Louis Levine, who's uh, now in Florida. We send our th sympathies. Um, in Florida? Nope. There used to be this radio station in... Uh, where were they? Were they were at a Cayucas or Cambria or somewhere, and then we'd go... Um, I think they were called K, K Otter, right? Stevie James. K Back when we were the kings of Cayucas. Mm -hmm. it, it was KOTR, K right? KOTR. And they would go, this is K Otter signing off to Cayucas, Cambria, uh, San Luis Obispo, blah, 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 Morro Bay, and all the ships at sea. <laughs> and so that's where this idea came from. Um, you know what? Because this is, because this is, uh, 
sort of churchy. Um, let's do the psalm. Jumping right in. What? Jumping right in. Psalm. Jumping right into the psalm. Tom's yeah. psalm. Um, I'm not sure that he faxed this to me from a submarine off the coast of the Solomon Islands. Wait, did I just give it away where you are? <laughs> no, not that. He was in the Bahamas. Do they have nuclear submarines in the Bahamas? <laughs> Who the fuck are they going to nuke in the Bahamas? And uh, um, All right. Maybe Mar Largo from there actually would be a great place to... Oh, perfect. Yeah. Right? Perfect. Easy picture. Right there. Easy. Easy? Yeah. Hard to miss. Yeah. <laughs> Just put the fucking dial on dumb fuckery yeah, and you're like, okay, yeah, hit there. And sorry. We try to be apolitical in the happy book because it doesn't make everyone happy. Um... Anyways, Tom, thank you. Psalm 4, um, 4 to 8. Tremble and do not sin. Meditate in your heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and trust in the Lord. Many are saying, who will show us any good? Lift up the light of your countenance Upon us, O Lord, you have put gladness in my heart, more than when their grain and new wine abound. In peace I will both lie down and sleep. For you alone, O Lord, make me to dwell in safety. Thanks, Tom. Dwell in safety. That would be a cool title for a song, but maybe not dwell, because nothing rhymes with it quite. What else could you do in safety? You could, you could, you could... <laughs> You can climb. Whoa. You can climb. Like you can climb. Yeah. Right? Like when there's a flood. Like when there's a flood. They say climb. And so, yeah, climb. instead of like dwell in it, because That'd then you be drown, you would cl climb to safety. That's a great idea. <laughs>
stretch across the bed we'll warm the milk and pat my head I might just go for tea instead Something green and Japanese If I could be calligraphy Cold black ink and energy Flesh and blood and poetry Or anything you need I hear her calling me And all the ships at sea And I believe Calling me, all the ships at sea, and I receive all my Mary, Mary, a Mary star.
trust what you can't see A living thing inside of me Flesh and blood and poetry She owns it with her eyes Heaven holds a place for lust Sex and love and God we trust And every feeling good and just She owns it with her eyes I hear her calling me all the ships at sea and I believe I hear her calling me yeah all the ships at sea and I receive all my Mary 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 Star That's a nice song. I don't only write ugly, sad death songs. I mean... Was that a panther track? What? Was that a panic song? Panther track. Did we do that one? I don't know if that song's ever been recorded. That's why I feel I like we it. did. I think we did it as a panther track. Did we do it as a panther track? What's going on with those panther tracks, Dex? We should release that whole thing. Make a record. I gotta say, man, when I signed a Panther fucking records, <laughs> they pro they promised me worldwide releases, distribution, yeah, whole deal, red vinyl, it's coming. it's coming. Travis Shallow, can you make a coffee cup that keeps my coffee hot, <laughs> like with a little heater thing in the bottom, maybe? Can you guys see that? Well, it's a really excellent picture of Travis Shallow. All right, I'm moving on. I'm moving on to uh, the winter edition Red Bull, Fig and Apple. Ooh, oh, <laughs> um, all right, well, uh, many people help us, you know. Um, thank you to Adam Ruback at Double Down. Thank you to Michelle Whiteson at Triple Down. Al Tribio. Um, what are the, wait, we want to go, uh, let's do the one that we don't know how to play first. Um, there was a brief moment I was in a band called the Stockholm Syndrome. We had high hopes back in the day. We were young. We were excited. Remember, remember feeling like that? <laughs> Ever feel like that? You were young and excited. Seem to remember something like that. Right? Yeah. You're like, fuck, man, the future was in front of you. In your case, you had this hair. You were like, I'm gonna fucking kill it out there. <laughs> um, anyways, expectations, man. You know, one second, you're living the dream, you're driving through Switzerland, and the next thing you gotta wear is fucking Waldo shirt on. <laughs> on Panther Records. Yeah. <laughs> Be honest, something. Um, I wrote this song with my friend Eric McFadden, and we were staying in a really nice hotel that was like a mall hotel, and somewhere in, I want to say it was in North Carolina, and it was connected to a mall, and people would come to stay in this nice hotel so that they could go to the mall. Um, that's not my La Jolla upbringing. Um, do you ever like? 
We were real molly in the 70s, right? In beach towns. Like, nobody went to the mall. It's like bowling. Who the fuck went bowling? I mean, just waves. Trivia was a big bowler, apparently, oh, yeah. back in Mexico when he was a kid. <laughs> yeah, we used coconuts. <laughs> Copenhagen? Coconuts. Oh, coconuts. Or chewing Copenhagen. Or... Yeah. <laughs> All right, anyways, um, this is this was McFadden's idea. I, I take, I bear no responsibility on this motherfucker. Um, I have no idea what it's about. But I gotta say, if it was anybody else's song, it would be their big hit. It would. Would have been a great Skinnerd comeback song. Um, right, this is called Red Lightning. I think. Do we know this, Stevie James? Hell yeah. Let's fucking kill it then, man. All right. Thanks, guys. <laughs>
Sorry we fuck up a jazzy middle part. It was like this cool part. Eric wrote it. We fucking torque it every time we pick it around. But we modified it. We modified it. Yeah. <laughs> um 
We're going to do some reggae songs, but, uh, you know, but I'd like to, I'd like to play that. There's an imaginary world where uh, I have a record coming out. <laughs> What's it called? There's an imaginary world where I have a full head of hair too, but um, the record the record is called uh, "Baby, You're the Man Who Would Be King." It was produced by my friend Eric Amble in uh, from from Cowboy Technical in in Brooklyn or in Greenpoint rather. And, um, it may be the longest I've ever taken to, from the point of writing songs, recording them. I thought The Beautiful Madness was a long time. This thing is fucking ridiculous. And um, theoretically, the only reason I'm bringing it up is because I got my, um, what do you call those things? That you're supposed to listen to? Oh, a test pressing? Yeah. That's exciting. I was supposed to bring them to you because oh. no one trusts. What the fuck am I going to say? Like, well, it's got lines. <laughs> I'm supposed to bring you the test pressings. Okay, thanks. So assuming that uh, Dex okay is the test pressings, um, then this record will come out sometime in the next 10 years. Baby, you're the man who would be king. Um, this song is on it. This is... Um, um, it's called 2020 Moons. Catch a fire Catch a fast train out of here A frequent flyer Knows it's time to disappear And there's a ledger I failed Well there must be something baby Keeps you here to tell the tale And now there's 20, 20 moons on the horizon And 20, 20 moons up in the sky And twenty, twenty reasons You should leave me Twenty, twenty ways To say goodbye Goodbye, baby your mama She got out earlier than most Just like my daddy They visit now and then as ghosts In New York City But I can still see you dancing in our morning side apartment And it feels like yesterday And now there's 20, 
Um, next week we're gonna do a, one more happy book, um, and uh, and then we're not gonna do it for a long time. So um, it's also Easter, Passover, all that's happening, which means we have ample material. Yes, we do. Lots of Jesus rising from the dead and frogs and crickets raining on right. Zombies. Zombies. Zombies and plagues and. Hey, rabbit song. We have shit tons of material for that. Um, in some argument, I might do a, a weird happy book from um, Oxted, England. Um, but as far as the cool version with all of us, this next week will be the last time for a while. So we hope that you can join us. Um, reminding you that the, the happy book is always free to those that need it, but uh, that we pretty much... How do you say it? We live or fucking die on your donations. So, uh, so feel free to... Whatever you do. However you... Go over to Al's house and bring him a casserole. He, casserole. he doesn't like broccoli, so no broccoli casseroles. Um, all right, well, that's about it. Now we got more shit to do, right? What are we gonna do next? Should we, uh... Shall we, uh... Louis Levine and his Rasta machine? Uh, yesterday was Lindley's birthday, right? Can I see that? And he would have been how old? 
Shit. He was old when we knew him, man. Let's stop that. Um, anyways, yeah, our friend David Lindley passed, as you all know, and um, yesterday was his was his birthday. I was listening to this um, song, which is on Win This Record, right? Yeah. That was one of the first... Um, It's that turning point, oh Lord. And why don't we do that song? That was one of the first songs um, that my old band Little Women ever played was Turning Point, our first cover. But we're going to do this one, um, which Lindley didn't write this, right? This is Melodians. Melodians. What's it called, Stevie James? Rock it with eye. Um, too bad we didn't have Jenny back on the drums uh, yeah, before. I know. That's pretty, it was, it was right? pretty uh, yeah. she was good. Right. Lick one drop, Jenny style. Um, there's a cool um, intro to this thing. I have no idea how it goes. So.
Jackson Rooney. Good. We got time for a couple more? We do, yes. All right. I was trying to remember what this song was about because I, I get so lost in the, what's this strummer stuff we do in the middle of it? Um, get down Moses. To the rock, to the rock. Where the Elijah, the king, 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 to the link, kong, 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 kong. 
You know what I'm saying? Skidip, skidip. Ting, 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 ting. Should I just do that for the rest of the show? Am I Where's Waldo shirt? Where Waldo? Waldo. I will say, where are ya? Um, me and Terry were on a plane. We were headed to the Dominican Republic and uh, it was one of those, you know, the pilot comes on, we don't want to alarm you. It's never good when the pilot, we don't want to alarm you. We're just fucking saying that is alarming. And, um, but we're turning the plane around, going back to JFK. And the way you come into JFK, I mean, like many airports, but for some reason I always think about the JFK. You're kind of coming over Queens, and they, they do a weird circle where it seems like from either side of the plane, at some point you see the airport. And, uh, and there's fucking fire trucks and emergency trucks and like all lined up. And uh, I think the only time I've, I've been next to a person more nervous was um, with Dax when the when the fucking missiles were hitting Tel Aviv and we're sitting on the fucking tarmac. <laughs> and you can hear it, you know, going, whoa, and the fucking alarms and Dex is looking at me like, now what? <laughs> I fucking know <laughs> what we do. But, um, so my wife-to-be was holding my hand and... The story had a happy ending. Um, well, if you like the happy book, it had a happy ending, because... Here. Um, and it was with the song Power Out, which is usually this crushingly, smashingly loud fucking thing. Um, I, I want to note, though, that we should be commended for never having once sang Dire Maker in the middle of um, one drum. <laughs> never one time, have we? Oh, 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 never once. We never did. Did you want to? No, I don't really want to. <laughs> I don't really want to do that. I used to like that song when I was a kid, but you don't have to go. All right. Are we going to do the intro, but we're going to do it like, um... Like, I don't know uh, what's going to happen. What? I, just, I have no idea what's going to happen. <laughs> Is this on a record? Did yeah. we ever record this song? Yeah. It's on Full Metal Burka, I think. Yeah. Full Metal Burka? I think so. A weird blood. Okay. I think it's Full Metal Burka. Thank you. 
can tell by the look in your eyes yeah. When you fight like a man who is drowning Calling the prophets by name in the light With the moves I need sounding All your prophets start looking the same Get down, Moses. Yeah, man. Oh. 
Fadden, Eric, Terribio, all the Eric's. Have we thanked everyone before we do this loud song that we're going to do? Because Al Terribio says he's been practicing it. <laughs> Which is weird, because I wanted to do Empire One, but I, but I haven't really paid attention to it, so we're going to do this instead. <laughs> Um, this is called The Jump. I don't know if we've actually played this very much at the Happy Book. We must have played it. No. 
going to jump right into a uh, strawberry apricot Red Bull. Hold me back, motherfucker. I'm ready to fucking throw the fuck down. You know what I'm saying? I got my Where's Waldo shirt. What do you think of the shirt? Too bad we can't hear the comments, because you know that they'd be going, fucking love the shirt, dude. It's Johnny Varvatos. No, it's not. I actually bought it, um, it was 20 bucks on Amazon. And I've never owned a red and white striped shirt. It's a bold shirt. statement. It's a bold yeah. statement, right? It says... You're owning it, man. You are owning it. Right? You are. Yeah. They tell me to be right-sized, right? So I'm thinking, yeah. like, it's just I'm going to right-size my way into... Where's Geraldo, or whatever the thing's called. Um, it's called The Jump. You all heard the, millions, the story a million times. Um... Many years ago, I had a I had a movie star friend who who was trying desperately to help me get clean. And uh, at one point, he flew me to Costa Rica and he put me in this mansion. And it was a fucking mansion on the beach and um, in Nosada, Costa Rica. And uh, the guy that owned the mansion that lived downstairs, his name was was Earl, and nobody could pronounce Earl, so they. They called him Julian. Um, just like nobody could pronounce um, Ralph, so we call him Al Alejandro. But it's really Ralph. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's hard to say Ralph when you're in. Um, all right. You know sometimes when you think you're funny and you're about halfway through it and you realize it's, it's fucking stupid. I'm not funny at all. It's just like... Anyways, Julian. Julian had this bodega, which is the, not the little grocery store on the corner, but they call them bodegas, and it's like your, like your storm cellar lockdown closet. You know? If you opened his, it was like this, this fucking wall of Coke, and then all these pharmacy bottles with like everything, and then um, guns and liquor. Pretty good combo. If you're ever trying to get fucking sober, <laughs> blow, pharmaceuticals, what's that shit called? Guado? Oh, yeah. Guado. Especially the ones that Vanny used to get, remember, that they'd drop off the boat or the three X's and the gas get can? The bleach bottles. <laughs> three X's. Anyways. It was all fun games until Julian decided we were going to go into town and get even. And everything went awry. Um, this is, this is, this is the jump.
6 this morning Four ginger Real and rum Blue Arthur The doctors wanted Yeah, they don't know He says I lost my Sense of fun But uh, my house It's big and spacious, baby Got a, got a lot, got a lot Got a lot, of, a lot of room
much for listening. Tides. I wonder if I can sing this cool. But pieces for accordion and piano. JennyColley.com. Thank you, Tom. Michelle and Adam and Louis Levine. We hope to see you next week. We hope you're fucking happy because this is the happy book and the point is to make you happy. Are you happy, out, Julio? Oh, yeah. Picture of Glee. This is our trivia on the guitar. Yo, at home, we can't hear you. Stephen Gabby Jesus on the drums. Stevie James right on the bass. Jenny Conley on the accordion.
Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, people. We're going to leave you with, with, our, with our featured cover song. If I'd had my shit together, we would have seamlessly rolled right into that, and I wouldn't have had to say anything again. Um, anyways, with a happy book, thanks again to Jenny. Tom and Adam and Michelle. And Louis Levine. Um.
I scratch your name out on that tree I chase your heart right out of me It doesn't mean that much Lights are turning red, the wheels are rolling on the ground. The day I burn a whole place down when the circus comes to town. Yeah, when the lights are turning red, the wheels are rolling on the ground. The day I burn a whole place down when the circus comes. When the circus comes. Circus comes to town. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go out to video. Dex, Steve James. God loves you, we love you. Bye. Nice job, everyone. Wait, there's no thing going on. Lung, kung, 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 kung. I'm the I'm the, I'm the keyboard. Thanks you guys. Bye.